Hey guys, it's Eric here at Farpoint Farm. Check it out. New Air sent me sent me something really cool, I'll be honest with you. New Air sent me this. It's a Cigar Club 250 count electric humidor with Opti Temp. This thing holds a lot of cigars and it's like a it's like going to the spa for your old stogies. You take this thing, you plug it in, you put your cigars in there, and it keeps it at exactly the right temperature range that cigars like to be kept. So if you're like me, you have a, a ton of vintage cigars. I like to collect vintage machine-made cigars as well as fancy cigars that people send me sometimes. And uh, I like to keep them in the best possible condition. So up until now, I've had little humidor boxes and you put the little tabs in there and you hopefully remember to put your distilled water in once a month. But it doesn't temperature control those cigars. So this, this thing has an air conditioner. This thing has a heater. And this thing has a humidifier and a slash dehumidifier, so it is able to keep this in the most perfect little universe for your classic collection of cigars. And that is why I'm happy to be able to check it out and see if it has any other cool stuff to talk about. It elevates the design of any room, it says. It does have a cool pattern on the side. I'll show you when you get it out. OptiTemp heating and cooling. Removable Spanish cedar shelves. It's thermostatically uh, controlled cooling and heating, and it's a digital hydrometer with a lock and key so you can keep unwanted folks out of your collection. Let me go ahead and get a knife out. We'll open it up. I'm going to be putting this inside the house, and, uh, and I'll bring you in there for, for the second half of this video, but I figured we could go ahead and unbox it out here because I don't have a ton of room anywhere inside, to be honest with you. Things are kind of crazy right now at the house. Right. Well, that's big. You know what? I think I'm just going to rip it open. Yeah. Box that way. Yeah, look at this. side it's like a, a uh, I'll go to the sideways here so you can see all sides of it decorated I think is what you would call that and it's like raised it's not just a printed thing it's a it's raised up very neat air vent back here and if we turn it around to the back side we've got the uh, vent and fan and everything for the back side of it all right power cord back here And here up front, really nice, look at this, really nice, adjustable, room for plenty, it also has a, looks like some kind of humidifier uh, that keeps track of there, oh, it smells great, you can smell that cedar, and then we have our manual, we have our locking key, here, another tray, and then a bottom tray as well. On the front, and this will be more evident when we get it inside, lights, uh, Celsius, you know, temperature control, Celsius Fahrenheit control, up and down. So, really cool. Let's go ahead and open this up. Let's see what it says. Super excited for this. I, I, don't, I don't smoke uh, very often anymore, maybe once or twice a year. And it's certainly not a habit I would recommend anybody get into, but uh, it is something that I enjoy. It was something that early on in my YouTube career, a lot of companies and a lot of people used to send me cigars to check out, and uh, and then I enjoyed that. So when they uh, people at New Air asked if I would be interested in this, I said certainly because I probably have several hundred cigars here at the house that are just not getting the love they deserve. Weighs 33 pounds. Uh, it takes 70 watts when it's fully running, so that's the air conditioning part of it. And uh, so it says it's recommended, and this is the reason I'm not going to be putting this out in the garage. It's recommended that you set up the cigar cabinet in a place where the ambient temperature is usually between 50 and 77 degrees. So basically indoors. You could probably go from a basement. I don't know if I'd put it in an attic, but 
anywhere indoors um, would be in a, in a good spot for it. It says it can take up to three days, it looks like, for this to get uh, just the perfect environment for your cigars. But since, like I said, they only smoke a cigar every uh, blue moon, um, I got plenty of days before the next time I smoke one, so that's pretty cool. I will say this, everything I've gotten from New Air has been top notch. I have no reason to believe that this won't be as well. And so I'm kind of excited. <laughs> Let me go ahead. I'm going to take this thing inside. We'll bring the camera inside, and I will uh, set this thing up, turn it on, and put some cigars in there, and that'll wrap up the video. I will also, of course, leave a link to where you can go ahead and get one of your own. These are right now just coming out. There's a pre-order for it. I was one of the early adopters here, so I'm really excited about that. But uh, soon they'll be available for everyone. Let's do it. All right. Well, here we are some time later, as they like to say on the Internet. And it is loaded up and running. I don't know if you can even hear it, but there's about the size it takes up. And you can see up top here we have a light that we can turn on and off. Celsius or Fahrenheit, and we can change our temperature up and down. We'll put it at 70. And then I'm going to open this thing up, and you can see inside. Of course, it's just getting started here, but our humidifier is at 55%, working its way up. And yeah, I can take you through a walk if you want to see what I've got all in here. Some of this will not impress you, some of it might. Uh, curly Head Fuentes, those are good. Romeo and Juliet, a couple of those. These are actually from my wedding. Got a rather rare Garcia Vega crystals. Another, what is that one? I don't even remember. Some of these I don't recall. Hoyo oh, Scalloper. I'm not sure where I got that one from. Some of these are gifts. Some are sent. A uh, couple of cheapies. Down in here, uh, these are vintage cigars. And I'll go through these with you real quick. Uh, El Productos from the 50s, Dutch Masters from the 50s, White Owls from the early 50s, a couple of really oldies there, one of the last um, El Producto, I think that was a Queen, there's a, a very old leaf wrapped King Edward cigar, down here uh, old boxes, look at that White Owl box, 62 cents, no barcodes on these. Box of AYC Grenadiers from the 60s. Another little white owl box there. And the bottom shelf, more uh, more recent stuff, cheap smokes. But yeah, you can see the whole thing here is just really nice. And I love the fact that it's got that little very dimly lit blue light. With the lights off in here, it gives off a nice glow. And down at the bottom there is a lock. Of course, I don't need to lock it here at the house. Uh, but if you had kids, definitely don't want them smoking, so... Good idea to lock it up. Well, I guess that'll do it. Again, I'll leave a link to where I uh, got this thing. And thanks again to New Air for working with me on this. This is a really cool product. Something that I will have for many, many, many years to come. Take care, my friends.